Wii U, it's the game console that's good for kids. I'm Scott Stein, and hey, the Nintendo Wii U console is two years old. It's hard to believe. It's never been the success, though, that the original Wii U was. Times have changed. The Wii U is, however, a game system with some really great Nintendo games. Is it worth $300, which is the going price for your typical bundle in stores? Well, that depends if you've got kids, or if you're a Nintendo fan. The Wii U's newest games, Super Smash Bros. and Mario Kart 8, are excellent to play in groups. And there are many other AAA games, Super Mario 3D World, Bayonetta 2, and Pikmin 3. And there are more. These are system exclusives, too. They look great in HD, but many games that you can get on the Xbox and PlayStation don't necessarily make it to the Wii U. The included gamepad with its own screen lets you play games away from the TV, and it works wonderfully, but its battery life is short. It does have built-in NFC, which works with new Amiibo figures, Nintendo statuettes that work with many games to unlock extras. They're more novelty than necessity, but they're cute and feel a lot like Skylander or Disney Infinity figures. The Wii U plays old Wii games, it streams Netflix, Hulu+, Plus, Amazon Video, and YouTube, but it can't play DVDs or Blu-rays. It's a great kid system, but it doesn't play well with the Nintendo 3DS, just keep that in mind. Some holiday bundles offer as many as four games for as low as $360. Get one of those if you can. Or make sure you get a version with 32 gigabytes of storage, not eight gigabytes. Trust me, you'll fill up on download space fast, but at least you can plug in a hard drive if needed. The Wii U is a really good system. Is it a must have? No, but it's got games that are well worth playing, especially for kids. I'm Scott Stein.